Hi there guys, this is Dino Sasha here and welcome back to another review. And today we're gonna to take a look at the figure is the Papo knockoff Comsignathus. Now Comsignathus, which name means elegant jaw, is a genus of a small bipedal carnivorous theropod dinosaur. Dad Okay, sorry about that, sorry about that for some time. Well, okay, as I was saying, Comsignathus is a genus of a small bipedal carnivorous dinosaur that lives in the late Jurassic period about 150 0.8 million years ago, what is known as Europe. Now, the length, but also only at about sometimes for the larger specimen. So the specimen was estimated about 70 to 75 centimeters to 26 to 30 inches and 87 centimeters, 35 centimeters in length. And approximately, and the other one was only about 1.5 centimeters, 4 feet and 1 inch. Uh, 1.4 centimeters to 4.7 inches. Now, for this one, it's a Greek, it's a French specimen. Is the old the only to say the German specimen is a much smaller than a French relative. Now, it, they were about the size of a chicken, but the only consisted that it's a close relative to an Archaeopteryx. They may have small, pre they have many predators, but they might be afraid of it. If you make a sort of Jurassic Park, The Lost World when Dieter Stark was killed by Consignathus, but in reality, they're afraid of large animals. Now, the carnivores, so they mainly eat bugs and small animals. So, let's talk about, the, let's take a look at the sculpt that, that this little guy. Okay, the sculpt looks the same as the, the real Papo version of it. And yeah, I really talk about this sometimes, but I think this referring to be Consignathus, this, you know, a specimen. It's resembled that it's a pro compsignathus, a triassic relative of compies. Yeah, basically, it's a really looking design of that dinosaur. And yeah, it's a really good skull, but it looks the same, but I digress. The pose is just like the same as the normal compie did. And yeah, I must talk about sometimes, it's just to make sure of that one's. Yeah, I'm mainly sure of that. So basically the pose looks the same as the original Papo figure is. It looks the same, but I like that. So it's the same detail like it did with before. Now, this is the same detail from before, so I like that sometimes. Well, let's talk about the the color scheme. It looks green with a yellow underbelly and a beige underside with green with the black stripes on it. And yeah, basically Comsignathus is one of the few dinosaurs could have such a really good design. Let's talk about the Compi's head. It has brownish eyes and, and a pitched mouth. And yeah, it can only open its mouth. Yeah, for concept, this figure is a very acceptable. When I was a child, I just loved to make stuff. Yeah, just a lot of that Compi. Yeah, I like the design of what Compi is a very, like, look like a, a real dinosaur. It looks like a real animal than a monster. Yeah, so the teeth looks excellent painted, along with the tongue. So, the accuracy, it looks like a bit of a Jurassic Park, and it's the same way. And you know what, I basically lock Comsignathus because it's the smallest dinosaur to ever exist. So yeah, that is it for now, but I will take a ruler, so let's see the measures. So, the measurements is start. When we take a look at the body structure with the tip of the tail, always tip of the tip of the top of the body we're looking at closely at about sometimes a little bit it is only at about six in the six and a half inches which is only at about unexpectedly yeah yeah let's think yep 17 centimeters and a height which is top of the head top of the snout loo looking at about just approximately four and a half inches and over approximately at about yep you guessed it 11 centimeters you well I don't need to compare to other animals because this is a large figure because if it's large that it's not possessed so I'll give it a out of 10 this is really good but it's not bad but it's really good but I must say most people did not review it because of its knockoff or papo figure or bootleg. But if it's a really nice figure because compies are really small but genetic predators. But yeah. So I regretted to make it sure that this little guy deserves a chance. 
being a dinosaur. A little fell over here. Yeah, so the Compies are really small and cute animals, but I think this Compy, this looks nice. It looks adorable and has a little teeth in it to chew down some insects and some animals. Well, they'd be preferring grasshopper, cockroach, some mice, and yes, tarantulas. Oh, you don't prefer Miss Tarantula? Who is, I made this video for the compi who ate Miss Tarantula because I call it the death of Miss Tarantula. What death? What her death was? Were being eaten by compi. Yeah, so that's when I discovered the bad guys takes an alternate prehistoric reality. You know, basically, when Mr. Wolf is a dire wolf, yeah, so that's what happens. If it takes for his mother, <laughs> yeah, I didn't know that. And for sorry for yelling, but I need me something out. I don't be mean to them. Well, I'm still have a, I have a little anger issues, but some. But the comfy, it makes me chill. Just, I think this must be every relative like, Consignifus longampus, which is every comfy family have this design of the Europe, from their lives on times, because I for the ones. I love these dinosaurs for some reason. Well, talk about the theory is that the Comsignathus, a French specif a French Compsy, well, I mean French Compy and a German Compy, are two different species because the French one is larger than a German specimen. That's all about that for sometimes. Believe it or not, that the Compy is look so nice at my review, but sometimes this will be not changed for sometimes. But I'll make another review. So this is going to be a much bigger figure than the mostly. Well, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to hit the like, subscribe for the channel, and click the bell for notifications so you'll never miss a video to get the money and leave a comment below. And I hope you see for another review about the Schleich Brachiosaurus. So goodbye everyone, and see you all next time on this channel. Good luck.